As restrictions go down, celebrations have come back. And a big one here in Hawaii is Lay Day. And this is coming just as we start pulling ourselves out of the pandemic. Shanila Kabir is live at Queen Kapi'olani Park in Waikiki. Good morning, Shanila. Good morning. We are here in Queen Kapiolani Park, where the largest May Day celebrations are held here in Oahu. I'm here with the Queen, Natalie Brown Aquin. So, so Natalie, tell me, what colors are you going to be wearing on May Day this Sunday? Okay, well, you know, I have the opportunity as Lay Queen to get to select the color. I'm the 93rd Lay Queen. My color is red this year, so I'm keeping it with the royal traditions, uh, red and yellow. Um, as Lay Queen, I get to select uh, my court, like my Pukani, uh, who is our conch shell blower, um, our chanter, our kahili bearers, our spearsmen. Uh, we get to follow the traditions for 94 years that we are still following our Hawaiian culture and getting people to come and enjoy the celebration. And what else is the lay court going to be doing? Um, for the lay, we have lay princesses. I have two lay princesses. They'll be dancing hula, so will I. Um, and then we have entertainment during that time. And any other events you want to talk about? Um, I do have events. Um, as Lay Queen, it's not only for May Day. I represent the city and county of Honolulu Mayor's Office and the Department of Parks and Recreation. And we have a year long, a calendar year long of, of activities that I work doing community service um, throughout the state. Well, thank you. And you heard it, May Day is back and you can experience it all here on Sunday. Reporting live, I'm Shanila Kabir, KITV4 Island News.